Hi, hi everyone. Uh, uh, today I'm going to show you how to access the practice platform and how to make a submission on uh, DeFi practice problem. Uh, so to begin with, uh, you can see that uh, you can go to DeFi.tech and uh, log in. Right now I have already uh, logged in, in my onto my profile. I'll just click on practice and here I can see a bunch of problems out here. So I can pick any problem of my choice. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll probably pick uh, this particular problem. Also, one quick thing you can also, you also have this filter wherein uh, unsolved, solved, and solving. So I'll probably go to the solved problems. Okay, there are no solved problems, unsolved. Uh, what I'll do is I'll probably go to uh, this problem, maybe, let me quickly go through this problem, predict the house prices, King County. Okay, I'll just click on solve. Now here I can see the overview of the problem what the problem is about and what is the problem statement and other stuff. And I can also go through the data set. Uh, here I can uh, see the complete data set, which I can use for uh, building a model. And after that, uh, I can also see the data description of this particular uh, data set. And there is something called as evaluation data set. Okay, so basically once you build your model based on this particular data, uh, you can evaluate your model on a new unseen evaluation data set. Okay. The only thing is here, we don't give any target variable. That is target variable is hidden with us and you need to predict the target variable with your machine learning model. Okay. Uh, and I think uh, the steps are already given and you can also follow through the steps uh, that I've mentioned in how to submit section. And on the submissions bar, uh, you can all, see all your submissions, all your submissions at the same time, all submissions that were made by different participants. Okay, and you can also see the leaderboard here. This, this, this makes it pretty cool where like, you know, you get to see uh, who, who the user is and like, you know, what are their ranks and a bunch of other things. Uh, you can also discuss about this problem on a discussion forum. So you just need to click on this and uh, by clicking on start discussion, you'll be taken to this discussion forum uh, where you can uh, reply to this thread and uh, yeah, respond to the questions or uh, probably you can also ask some questions related to this uh, particular uh, problem. Okay. Uh, again, coming back now, there is a tab called a salt tab. Okay. Uh, that means that like, you know, once we are done building our model, we go to this salt tab and uh, once we go here, we need to put our predictions out here in this particular square bracket in comma separated format. Okay. Um, how do we do that? Okay. Let me quickly try and solve this problem. I, I already have a Jupyter notebook, uh, uh, a collab notebook where I loaded this particular data set. So I tried to load the data first and then um, try to build a very simple linear regression model. As you can see, uh, I built a linear regression model out here and then uh, try to first thing that I've done is uh, I tried to check the model performance on the training data set. And then I tried to check the model performance on the test data set. So basically initially we get the data set and we try to uh, split that particular data set into train and test. And that's where like I'm trying to check the performance. And now comes the uh, last step that is nothing but um, uh, basically like, you know, we need to make a submission on the, on the platform, right. By using the evaluation data set. So that's when we try to load the evaluation data set. Uh, and, uh, and then, uh, we try to predict our target variable using the machine learning model that we have built. Okay. So here, as you can see, we have built the model as model dot predict. How did we do that? If we go a few steps back we trained a model using model dot predict x train so we are using the same model to do the evaluation model dot predict but we are using the evaluation data set here okay once this is done we need to save the prediction results by using uh, this particular piece of code on collab whereas if you want to save it on uh, jupyter notebook you can use this particular code okay i'm using this particular piece of code I'll just click on this and um, probably, yeah, allow. And then I'm able to get this prediction file. Okay, let me just quickly open this prediction file. 
and uh, as you can see i can see all the va values now we need to convert them into the comma separated format right so i just need to uh, select all these values and then um, let me go back to the problem statement how to submit right so here i was given some help links i'll probably go to dlm.co and then uh, put my predictions and um, click on this button so that i get the comma separated values i go back here just need to click on solve again uh put the predictions in the brackets okay so if you want to see all the submissions you can click to see more but it's not required i, uh, I believe and go uh, scroll down and then click on submit that's it and we'll be waiting for our result and um yeah we got our result so uh, basically uh, this is our score and let's check a leaderboard okay it takes time to populate i guess maybe well yeah we are on uh, rank two uh yeah that's basically about it uh yeah thanks